In this activity, you will identify the factors affecting business and employees. Rahan has done a course in baking. He now wants to bake and sell bread through various outlets. Most of the bread sellers in the market are selling wheat flour bread through grocery shops. Rahan has a few strategies to create his place in the market in the face of competition. Identify which competition strategy he is applying in each case. Rahan bakes regular refined wheat flour bread and sells it through grocery shops at the lowest price than his competitors. Select the most appropriate option and click Submit. That's correct. Rahan is aiming to lead the competition by offering a lower price. Rahan bakes multi-grain bread and sells it through grocery shops. Select the most appropriate option and click Submit. That's correct. Rahan is targeting a broad market, but wants to lead the competition by offering a product with unique features. Rahan bakes multi-grain bread and sells it through leading bakeries by establishing tie-ups with them and offering a competitive price. Select the most appropriate option and click Submit. That's correct. While Rahan's competitors are selling refined flour breads through grocery shops, he is offering multi-grain bread through bakeries which is a niche market at a competitive price. Rahan bakes burger buns and sells it to leading restaurants at a good price. Select the most appropriate option and click Submit. That's correct. Rahan is applying the differentiation focus strategy since he is targeting a niche market and offering a better product so that he can charge more than his competitors. Here is an opportunity to check your understanding of the market fluctuations affecting business and strategies to stay ahead of the competition. Select the game mode. In this mode, you can explore different responses and get feedback on your choices. Check your knowledge on the adapt to change. This is Ruby, a young woman who had been working as a tailor for women's clothes at a fashion designer's boutique for four years. Hi, I'm Ruby. She now wants to open her own boutique. Ruby has done a diploma in sewing. Through her experience in this business, she knows how the market fluctuates. She wants to use the dynamics of the market to her advantage and earn decently. She also wants to race ahead of the competition and gain a loyal customer base. Your task is to help her make the right business decisions. In her experience as a tailor, Ruby has observed people prefer stitched clothes for weddings. Most of the brides want customized clothes, Ruby wants to make a good profit in this scenario. What do you think Ruby should do to maximize her profit in wedding and bridal wear? Read the options or click the audio icon to hear the options. Select the most appropriate response and click submit. Well done. Ruby's customers will pay her extra only when she provides unique service that is not available elsewhere. In her experience as a tailor, Ruby has observed people prefer stitched clothes for weddings. Most of the brides want customized clothes, Ruby wants to make a good profit in this scenario. How should Ruby handle the increased demand and make a profit during all the festivals that occur throughout the year? Read the options or click the audio icon to hear the options. Select the most appropriate response and click Submit.
Well done. If Ruby has a mixed team of some junior tailors on a permanent basis and some tailors on an ad hoc Ruby wants to provide some services to her customers that her competitors do not provide. She has observed that some people want formal clothes to wear in office. Very few tailors stitch formal clothes well but Ruby knows this job. Should Ruby get into the business of stitching formal clothes? Read the options or click the audio icon to hear the options. Select the most appropriate response and click submit. Well done. Ruby can always provide unique designs to her customers and stitch the clothes such that they fit her customers well. This will make her customers happy, give her more business and also a competitive edge over other tailors. Ruby has observed that she can get good business for stitching casual clothes throughout the year. Ruby wants to be efficient in getting the casual clothes stitched. A lot of time is spent in getting the design right. This affects productivity and hampers growth. What would you suggest Ruby in reducing the turnaround time of stitching casual clothes? Read the options or click the audio icon to hear the options. Select the most appropriate response and click submit. Ruby should provide a catalog of popular designs to her customers. Ruby should ask her customers to bring their own designs from the internet. Ruby should have display pieces of some popular designs ready so that it is established upfront what the final product will look like. Well done. If Ruby keeps some display pieces ready, her customers will get a complete idea of the finished product and there will be no differences once the stitched clothes are ready. Ruby has observed that she can get good business for stitching casual clothes throughout the year. Ruby wants to be efficient in getting the casual clothes stitched. A lot of time is spent in getting the design right. This affects productivity and hampers growth. Which service should Ruby focus on? Read the options or click the audio icon to hear the options. Select the most appropriate response and click submit. Well done. In formal wear, Ruby can showcase her talent of stitching. Although she will offer a competitive price, profit margin on formal wear would be high nevertheless. You have successfully helped Ruby understand the variations in the market and ace the competition.